This video is on how to file rectification request for return data correction. Let us first see what is a rectification request. When a return is filed by a taxpayer, it is processed by the income tax department and an intimation is sent to the taxpayer under section 143 subsection 1 based on the details disclosed by the taxpayer and the rules deployed by the processing center of income tax department. In case the taxpayer wants to seek the rectification of any mistake in the intimation received under section 143 subsection 1, the taxpayer can file a rectification under section 154. Please note that the rectification can only be filed for an error which is apparent from the record. The rectification request service is available to all taxpayers registered on the e-filing portal, registered ERI users, registered authorized signatories, registered representative assessees in case the taxpayer wants to engage one. The service is available only after login to the e-filing portal. Let us first see what are the prerequisites for filing a rectification request. For filing a rectification request, you should be a registered user on the e-filing portal with valid user ID and password. You must have received an intimation under Section 143, Subsection 1 of the Income Tax Act. If the rectification is required to be filed by an ERI, then the taxpayer must have added the ERI using My ERI service. And for registered ERI users, they must have added the taxpayer as a client using the Add Client service and the status of ERI should be active. There are three categories of rectification requests. Rectification request for reprocess the return, rectification request for tax credit mismatch correction, and rectification request for return data correction in the offline mode. In this video, we would be talking about return data correction in the offline mode. In order to file a rectification request for return data correction, you are required to log in to the e-filing portal using your valid user ID and password. Post login, go to services and click on rectification. On the rectification page, click on new request. You are required to select whether you are filing a rectification request for income tax or wealth tax and select the relevant assessment year. Please note that the rectification is available only for orders passed by CPC under Section 143, Subsection 1, read with Section 154 of the Income Tax Act. Post selection of the relevant assessment year from the drop down, you can click on Continue button. You are required to choose Return Data Correction in the offline mode. Please note that this request type is applicable when the taxpayer wants to correct any data in the ITR already filed. Also, it is to be noted that the taxpayer need to upload XML generated in offline utility for filing rectification up to assessment year 1920. From assessment year 2021, they can upload the JSON and submit the rectification request. While making corrections, please make sure that you do not enter any new source of income or declare any additional deductions. Once you have selected the request type as return data correction offline, you would be required to attach the rectified return in the JSON or the XML format. In order to create the rectified JSON or the XML file, you are required to download the pre-filled ITR in the XML or the JSON format. Click on Download ITR XML or JSON. The downloaded XML or JSON file will be available in the download section of your computer. Now you can log out and in the pre-login mode, go to the Downloads tab. Here you are required to download the utility for the relevant assessment year. Select the assessment year for which you want to download the utility or file the rectification. Select the ITR form. Now click on the utility based Excel for the relevant ITR form. The utility will be downloaded in the download section of your computer. You can double click on the zip file and then open the Excel utility for the relevant assessment year. Enable the macros if blocked. Go to part A general sheet and click on import JSON. Import the ITR file that you have downloaded earlier. Once the file will be imported in the utility, you can make the necessary rectification. Validate each sheet and generate a JSON file. And then again log in to the e-filing portal. Go to rectification and return data correction and upload the rectified JSON. You would also be required to enter the reasons for rectification. Attach the file and click on save as draft. 
you can then click on submit button once the rectification is submitted successfully you will be seeing a success message kindly note the rectification reference number finding a rectification for return data correction is very easy to know more you can visit our website www.incometax.gov.in or contact our helpline numbers